found me, huh? We found you! Finally! You've been, you've been running from us. Hiding in the motorhome. <laughs> the real essence of RAM, surviving on the climbs to 3,000 meters, surviving, not racing. I know, well, you know, we did get uh, Yuri a little bit on the road and he did look like he was suffering. Yeah, but it was not like you wrote or somebody wrote that he had uh, stomach problems. And we were laughing, there was no, he was just coughing up when uh, uh, going out of the motorhome. So that was not true. Oh, we he was just, oh, he was coughing, but he didn't have stomach problems. No, we had other problems. So what, what was going on with Yuri then? Um, it, apparently, because he, last night when he went for a first uh, sleeping pit stop, he was not able to get asleep. So he was not able to get rested. So when the climb to Wolf Creek Pass came, he was exhausted. He, he was really suffering getting up there. And then we decided that the only way is that we, we stop him for two hours and he was sleeping for the whole two hours. Wow, Yuri first, got a two hour first sleep. Time, <laughs> first time in, in our rams, he slept for two hours. Uh, he was cold, he, he got slowly back in business, eating a lot and uh, then another climb. And when we got to Alamosa, he stopped for regular sleep. So there was three hours sleep in one night. Wow, that's a lot for Yuri. Then he came back slowly and slowly, but then after Alamosa going to La Veta Pass, we had this hurricane headwind, you know, it was like stopping him. And he was again suffering, getting up there. And then the third one uh, over there, and now he's down, all three passes are uh, behind him. He's slowly getting back. And the lead uh, out from Gulovic even increased to three hours, 51 minutes, which was surprisingly for us. That means even Gerhard had a lot of problems with that weather. So Everybody did, everybody did. It was a tough, tough night for everyone. Yeah, so it, so that confirms that it was not problem. <clears throat> there were no problems in Yuri's hell, but problems with weather. <laughs> Yuri will not go, he decided never again. This is too much, this is, this is yeah. because when we went down from Wall Creek Pass, he was so sleepy, we were talking to him, we were singing, we were yelling, we were, I don't know, talking, uh, reading news from the from the internet, just to keep him awake, he was really... Uh, why do you think it's harder this year than in past? Why, why do you think he needs more sleep now? Uh, he said that, first of all, there was a lot of tailwind in the desert and he used that with really pushing hard and that was, that was not so smart. Because then when he came to, the, to stop, to, to rest, he was in full power mode. He could not fall asleep instantly. So after an hour lying in the back, on the back, he said, I cannot sleep, I'll go on. And that was too much. So he was not uh, sleeping after 36 hours, but let's say after 48 hours for the first time, literally. So he, he just pushed himself too hard at the beginning. Yeah, yeah, that was the problem. And he didn't train anything, any, uh, any training at all in the heat this year. So he said that he was quite surprised with the heat and he kind of uh, forgot how it's like in the desert, so... <laughs> how many years in Ram? Him, eight. <laughs> <laughs> eight years in Ram and he forgot about the heat. Yeah, it's one year, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you get, uh, you, you forget bad things, you know, you, you delete it. That's true, I forget bad things. things from, uh, from, from your head, so... <laughs> that's true, that's true. Well, it is raining and cold, so I don't want to keep you out here, but thank you so much. Um, and uh, we'll, we'll talk to you soon and turn this off. But, um,